Welcome to STB exam forum. We have come up with a new video for admin and allied cadre. So in this video we are going to see the detailed syllabus for quantitative aptitude section. Okay. So in the last sessions we have seen notification, job profile of each post code and the syllabus for general awareness which include both static and current affairs. So if you have not watched this video, we have made a playlist for admin and allied. You can watch uh, this video. This video can be helpful for you. Okay. So this is a selection process uh, where first uh, tier one will be CBT computer based test. And for the most of postcode, there will be 75 number of questions. Okay. And each question carry one mark and the duration of exam would be 60 minutes and student one more thing there will be no negative marking okay and as you can see there are four sections and we are covering syllabus for each of the section based on our past exam experience okay so uh, the total number of questions in CBT is as I told you there will be 75 question and each question carry one mark and there will be no negative marking and there will be four section so if we divide 75 questions divided by four so we can expect uh, 18 to 20 questions for quantitative aptitude okay so 18 to 20 question can come uh, in the quantitative aptitude section of cbt exam okay so first try to understand uh, what is the objective of quantitative aptitude in any competitive exam so the very first fundamental objective is basic mathematics concept. Okay. So we are studying mathematics uh, starting from our childhood to the college's days. Okay. So do you have the basic concept that is only the purpose they have. Okay. And the second objective is are you able to solve basic mathematic problem? Uh, that is the second objective. Okay. And uh, the most important point is the challenge. So what is the challenge for quantitative aptitude section for the most of student? It is speed and accuracy. Okay. We know all the concept, but because we have a limited time duration, so we uh, cannot spend more time in solving one question. So speed matters. Okay. Similarly, accuracy also matters. So the challenge for quantitative aptitude is speed and accuracy. But the good thing is we have an opportunity for preparing this section. What is that opportunity? It is common for all the competitive examination. So if you are preparing for DRDU septum or banking or SSC, whatever exam, the quantitative aptitude, most of the topic will remain same. Okay. So you prepare quantitative aptitude. Uh, it will be beneficial for other competitive exam also. Okay. So let's see the topic. So these are the topics uh, that you can find in all the competitive examination books. Okay. So these are the topics. Okay. So I divide all these topic into two categories. First one is the must do topic. Okay. That you should not ignore. You should must do all these topic, which I am, I am going to tell you in few seconds. Okay. So the very first topic in all these topics is average student. We have seen one to two question from the average chapter itself. Okay. So prepare this chapter very well. Okay. This is very easy and uh, very scoring chapter. Okay. Second, second one is ratio and proportion. It is also a very uh, important topic because uh, this is interrelated related chapter average ratio. So some questions uh, might be related to average, but they also include a ratio in that. Okay. Then percentage or uh, it is one of the most important topic in all the competitive examination. You can find one to two questions from percentage as well. Then a uh, similar uh, like profit and loss. Uh, it is also a very important topic then ci and si time and distance time and work student these are the must do topic okay these are very scoring topic if you do okay 
but the challenge is again uh, they have lot of questions okay so you have to focus on your concept first after that you practice each questions and dedicate some time for quantitative aptitude okay so these are the must do topic you can take a screenshot of this okay just try to understand each and every chapter very well okay then only you can answer those question quickly coming to the other topics so that must do topic you should do okay but the other topics you should not ignore but you have some basic understanding of all those topics you can have a look on the formulas okay that is uh, in the other topic section okay so what are the other topics quadratic equation we have seen in the last exam quadratic equation one to two question has come then from mensuration there are lot of questions student so practice mensuration as well then probability then trigonometry so in stab exam we have seen a lot of question on trigonometry so if you have a basic understanding of trigonometry you can answer a few questions very well okay so the thing is that we don't know whether this time probability or trigonometry will come in admin allied or not so that's why i have put all these topic in the other section okay next boat and strip and pipes and system these are easy topic but uh, have a look on all the formulas and concept if you have time after preparing that must do topics okay that we have seen in the last slide okay the number system is also one other important topic so take a screenshot of this uh, uh, slide yes okay now the next question uh, which can come in our mind is how to prepare quantitative aptitude for admin allied okay so first thing is you clear the basics of each topic okay how can you clear yes by reading books by watching some useful videos on youtube or you can also uh, take some coaching from some coaching center okay second one is try to understand the category of questions which are generally asked in the ex exam okay so one thing is you know the chapter second thing is what are the types of question which are coming in the exam continuously so those category of questions you should know okay then as i told you earlier practice daily on each category of question okay you can practice with the help of some books or with the help of some mock test okay and most importantly whatever you are doing practicing try to do by writing or by solving okay write down the, all the formulas write down all the shortcuts okay write down what you have understood writing is very important because writing will incorporate your knowledge into your subconscious mind okay and next very important is the revi revise each topic okay once you cover uh, a topic after few days you revise those topic okay so revision is very important students so students uh, that's all uh, we will come with the next video few days okay so thank you and if you have anything to say you can write in our comment box thank you have a nice day